Are you having fun in your business? I mean, it should be fun, right? Well, sometimes the fun gets overlooked when you're dealing with the have-tos, the complexities of being your own boss and actually running the show. It's my goal that this, the Fun Business Fun Money Podcast, can help reignite your spark of fun by providing tips, tools, insights, and inspiration so you can enjoy running your business in the simplest, easiest, most fun way possible. I'll be sharing practical tips and ideas that you can implement immediately, along with business and money mindset insights to keep you moving forward no matter what's going on around you. I'm your host, Deirdre Amies, the fun business and money coach and founder of Powered by Personality. Let's play. Hey there, and welcome to the Fun Business, Fun Money podcast. Now, if you've been listening for a while, hey, um, you will know that today is a quick tip, tool, or tactic episode, which ideally is less than 10 minutes. So let's just see if I can actually do that, shall we? I think today, I'm not sure if it's a tip or a tactic. I don't know. You decide. We'll see by the end. I've titled this episode, There Is Always More. Now that may be a new concept for you, or maybe not. I can't remember where I first heard it, but I do know that it's had a massive impact on me. It's like a huge relief, and I hope it does the same for you. So in a nutshell, it's about shifting from a scarcity mindset and fear that there isn't enough not enough clients, money, time, energy, all of those things. And instead of all of those low frequency emotions that definitely don't help you grow, it's about shifting into the future focused mindset of abundance that there is always more, more clients, more time, more money, more energy, more than enough for everyone any time that you want. This applies to everything in life, but of course it's particularly relevant for business and money. Move away from seeing others as your competitors, even when they do the exact same thing that you do. So as an example, let's say you're a podiatrist and What do you know? There's another podiatrist in the same geographical area as you. That's great. You can both contribute to better foot health in your community. You'll each attract different clients for different reasons. And you don't have to agree on everything, although it would be amazing if you had a great working relationship where you are respecting each other as peers in the same industry. Imagine if you could collaborate in ways that don't take anything away from your client base. That's a benefit to your whole community. There's an exponential impact. There are always more benefits for you and your community, whatever it is, when you shift out of scarcity mindset and embrace the idea that we're better together. Another example, maybe you're a health coach. There are certainly a lot of those out there in the online world. Who are you competing against? Really, that it's no one but yourself because there is an entire human population out there searching for the help that you can provide. One person, one business cannot possibly serve the needs of everyone. Therefore, there are always more people who need you. You see where I'm going with this? Expand your thinking and get out of scarcity. See the bigger picture and increase your awareness of the possibilities instead of fearing that you're going to somehow lose what you already have. Because guess what? That's a self-fulfilling prophecy. Now, one of my favorite things that I tell my clients to do whenever something important comes up is to put it on a post-it note. 
So grab a post-it note or a piece of paper and some blue tack, some way to stick it somewhere that you'll see it as a constant reminder. And write down, there is always more. So you get to decide what more relates to in any given moment. But this is your reminder to shift out of scarcity and fear and into feeling abundance and peace. There is always more money. There is always more clients. There is always more time. There are always more ideas. There is always more of whatever it is that you need if you just expand your awareness and see it. There is always more. And that includes more fun business, fun money episodes each week. Make sure you hit follow on your favorite platform, whether it's Spotify, Apple Podcasts, or any of the others, so that you don't miss any of the episodes when they go live. If you like what you're hearing, it would be amazing if you could share it with someone who would also like it. And take a few seconds to rate it on Spotify or leave a review on Apple Podcasts, because that also helps it to reach more people. And of course, I will be forever grateful to you for showing the love. So that's what I got for you today. Take care, have fun, and remember, there is always more. Thanks for joining me. If you found this episode useful, make sure you hit that follow button on your chosen podcast platform so you get the notifications when each new episode goes live and you don't miss anything. If you know someone who would also get something from it, don't be shy, share it with them. One of the best things about being a business coach for online entrepreneurs is helping them make sense of their creative ideas and turn them into a simple, clear business system that actually makes money. A client recently described me as a castle building expert. You've got the big vision and some of the building materials already but you don't quite know how to bring it all together into a solid foundation. Then I come along and I show you the blueprint that makes sense of it all. I love that analogy. And I'd love to show you your personalized blueprint, the one that's just right for you and your clients. But I can't do that until you join Ignite, my business and money coaching program. So head on over to deirdreamies.com forward slash ignite for all the details. Fill out the application form and let's talk about building your castle in the simplest, easiest way possible.